Hey guys, we're back out here at the lumber yard. I'm gonna break some of these bigger little chunks down for the charcoal machine. We're gonna make get a little charcoal started today. So I'll break these down real quick on the super split. And then we're gonna mill. I have a really nice piece of ash. This charcoal, don't ha I don't have to split these too small. Like these big ones right here. I'll probably split those, something like that, in quarters. Guys, if you're interested in making charcoal, this lump charcoal for your grills, for your friends, for their other family members, go back and check out my video on making lump charcoal. I remember I'll try to put a link in the description. Or maybe I'll just put it up in the corner. Nice. Yes, sir. So I had a few that didn't finish the process, so we're gonna throw those back in. Now that I think about it, I think I only made one burn. I've been I've been making two burns in most of these, so probably half this will go back in. That was my fault. I put uh, only one fire on it. I remember that now. I've been getting two fires going. Yeah, pretty much all of it. It wasn't quite ready yet. You know when it's ready, when it just snaps like that. But you can still see there's a little bit of wood left in this one. That ain't gonna snap. Yeah, I didn't get, that was bad, Jerry. Oh, that's a good one. All right, we got some. We're gonna load that can back up and get this thing lit up. Fourteen and a half inch. Nine feet two inches. Fourteen and a half inch. Things perfect. One of you asked me, and I think it's really a good idea, they give you some more stats. Uh, I give you some board footage every now and then. So a fourteen. A 14 inch log is gonna give us a 10 inch cant. I should have been able to do that in my head. And how much does it weigh? This is ash, so let's find out. Here we go. 600 pounds exactly. This, this log weighs 600 pounds. It's going to yield a 10 inch cant, so we'll probably get 11. And it's gonna be about 76 between 60 and 75 board feet. Probably closer to 75 for us, we'll get on the big side. Mill's warmed up. I'm gonna do this in three quarter inch slabs and, cause I do need a lot of three quarter inch boards. I was really too high on that, or too low on that first.
I want to show you something, guys. Hopefully, you can hear me over the motor. This is a new mic. I got a crack. It looks like it runs the whole length of this thing. I imagine this log was pushed down with the excavator. So let me show you. Ooh, sun's out. It runs the whole length. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to take three quarter inch boards down from here until I get the six inches. Then I'm going to turn it because I really want six inch boards and I can't get them out of there. So I'll come down until I get the six, then I'll turn it and I'll get a few going this way. I'm down to six inches left, so I'm gonna flip it up. And now I'm gonna cut three quarter inch boards all the way down to the back. I clean the mill every single time I'm done using it, just so it's easier the next time I go out. No, I didn't put any filters in or do any editing to the lighting here. This is where the sun started peeking out finally. It lightens up really fast. Just a little bit. Oh, yeah, B. Well, I just did the math, guys, and we're at 73 board feet. So we're pretty close to that Doyle scale. I think we did a little bit better. We have it 11, 3 quarter inch by 6 inch by 110 inch. Um, and then we had 6 three quarter inch by nine by 110 inch. So approximately 70 board feet, 73 according to the calculator, but yeah, around 70 ish. Got warm out here, the sun's out, we got the charcoal going. Got a few things split up, some more uh, of the charcoal lumps split up. So this is a good day today. It's cooling off, it's middle of September now, and I'm really enjoying this weather. I think it's only supposed to be in the low 70s today, so. So if there's anything you want to see, let me know that charcoal. I'll probably put that video up here in the corner. You can watch, check that out if you want to see how I make my charcoal. Um, I believe I only had one burn on that. I've been trying to get two burns on each each uh, batch. So that batch should be done after this burn. I'll probably do two on it just because I threw some more in it. So guys, take care. We'll see you at the mill next time. Have a great day.